My name is Leslie McBain, and I am an advocate for drug policy change in the direction of harm reduction. When my son Jordan was about, I would say about 14 years old, he and his pals were smoking pot, drinking, uh, partying. It was always partying. It grew rather than diminished over the next few years. And by high school, um, I could see that he was having a problem with, with pot and uh, probably cocaine, although I, it was guessing. I was guessing at that point. When he was 23, he had a back injury on a job. And he went to our family doctor, and the doctor prescribed OxyContin for him. Um, it didn't take very long for him to become totally addicted to, to Oxy. It's the stereotypical idea of somebody who needs the drugs. He lied, he stole, he um, denied that he had a problem until it was so critical that he came to us, his father and I, and said, um, I need to go to detox, I need to, I need to fix this. He seemed, after about two months, he seemed like he had, um, that he was clean and that he, that he had beaten this thing. Um, but that wasn't the case. And one day he, I'm not sure because I wasn't with him, but what it looks like happened is he couldn't find enough oxy or he couldn't afford it. He had doctor shopped and he got several opioids and he, just the cocktail that he mixed for himself, basically, of these drugs to help him uh, not withdraw, killed him, stopped his heart. I think all parents need to know that in every single high school in this country, there are there is the potential for um, obtaining drugs. Uh, and if a parent is judgmental, if a parent is um, angry, the child will close down. It, it's just the way it is. That's that's life. Uh, so the conversation has to be a calm and measured conversation with facts and no blame, no shame. No, no stigmatizing, no threats. It has to be the straight talk on what can happen. What I have here is a naloxone kit. Naloxone is um, the antidote to an opioid overdose. It should be carried by anyone who is either living with someone who is taking drugs or is in the area where people are taking opioid drugs. Anyone who is using the drugs should get one of these. It's really important in saving lives. <laughs>